Hi there, Mr. Brain Dead Kennedy. How are you and your 4,000 brainless sheep followers? Enjoying the show so far. <coughs> now, Mr. Brain Dead Kennedy, the video you are about to see now must be the most convincing video ever produced on YouTube that proves without question irrefutable evidence that one, NASA faked the moon landings, they never went. Two, NASA faked the Chinese lander and the uh, rover Jade Rabbit and for publicity purposes. Three, proves without question that the LRO is fake, it does not exist. Four, proves that the photos produced or claim to be produced by the LRO are all faked. They are impossible. And we'll finish with five. Have you ever heard of the saying, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Now, this video of mine here, titled, Expat Taffy's Dogs Prove NASA Faked the Moon Landings, it provided such irrefutable evidence, it shook the NASA administration down to the core. They realized immediately, they have dropped a very, very heavy bollock. Nobody else have noticed it in 48 years. Only the brilliant expat Taffy, thanks to a little tipper from my dogs. And as you will see from the video coming up. Now, take a look at this photo here, AS17-140-21368. Now, while this very important clue is in this photo here, it is not just in this one photo. Out of around about 3,500 photos allegedly taken on the moon, this certain clue is common in at least a half of those, maybe about 1,500 photos. Here you are. Here's another one. AS15-82-11056. As you can see, this photo has been photoshopped. This is the Apollo 15 LEM waiting to take off. But the clue is in here as well. OK, we now go from the Apollo moon photos to the LRO photos. And you've got the clue in this photo here as well. And this one here. Can any of you spot it? A clue that tells you that the photo is impossible. And here is another LRO. Something that tells you that it's completely impossible. Come on, anybody spot these clues yet? Right, we're now going from the LRO to Jade Rabbit. And it's really staring you in the face here. Anyone spot it? Well, my dogs know about it, folks. So come on, use your brains. Any of you spot it? A clue telling us it's impossible? And here's another one. The vital clue is staring you in the face. Something telling you this is completely impossible to have been taken on the moon. Now, let me say, with this jade rabbit, due to new discoveries, the brilliant expat Taffy will soon be proving categorically that this jade rabbit is fake and not on the moon. So, for any of you who never spotted the clue, let's get back to Bobby, shall we? who provided me with this clue, and it's staring you right in the face. Now, this dog of mine, Bobby, he's not a native dog of Thailand. But one thing about Bobby is his hair grows pretty quick. It grows pretty long, and periodically my wife has to trim his hair because he's too hot in this climate of Thailand. Now, the surface of the moon is claimed to be around about 135 degrees Fahrenheit. That's hotter than what it is here in Thailand. That's because we've got an atmosphere cutting down the heat from the sun. But, with it not being so hot, it's still too hot for these dogs of mine to sleep on the ground. The surface here is around about 30 to 35 degrees centigrade. So what do these dogs of mine do? You can see what he's done here. Bobby has started digging a hole. These two dogs of mine know that the more they dig down, the cooler and cooler the soil gets lower down. And there's a reason for that. And the reason the soil is cooler 
the lower down Bobby goes is due to one thing, a common factor you've seen with all the photos up to now, and that is water. The soil below here has a water content on the earth, folks. And here is one of Bobby's favourite places for sleeping. He's constantly digging a hole below this bench because he knows he's out of the sun and he's into cooler soil below. We keep got to fill this back in because one time the bench did collapse into the hole. Now take a look at this photo here. There's Bobby and Dodo near the top of the page. What we've got here is a newly constructed road with massive new development nearby. Now, this photo here is taken one day after we had a good downpour of rain. But what we had was quite a few hours in the morning that we had good sun and it dried up the road. As you can see, plenty of the soil is light coloured where it dried. But then along came the excavators and look what it's done folks. It's disturbed the dry light coloured soil on the top and produced a dark colour soil where it trapped. The dark soil being soil that has got a water content. Well, are you all getting the picture? Now we'll take a look at some of the moon photos again and let's see what we can see, shall we? Well, there you are, folks. Are you now getting the picture? All the moon photos where they show astronauts have been walking, they claim kicking up the dust, kicking up the soil, disturbing the soil, and the rover doing exactly the same. They're showing that there's a darkened area of soil. Now, on the moon, folks, that is completely impossible. There is no water on the moon. So, whatever soil or regolith is on the moon, six inches down is going to be just as dry as the surface, and it's going to be the same colour. A different colour, folks, is impossible. Same goes for this one. Completely impossible. You cannot have two different shades of soil as they are showing here. And here is that photo, proof of it. It's been photoshopped. And with Photoshop 3.0, that was introduced into America in the year 2007. So this photo was made after 2007. Now look at you folks, you've got it again. More pronounced in this one, Jade Rabbit. That black track is completely impossible. You can't have a black soil under the surface. Well folks, now we've dealt with them. Let's take a look at the LRO photos, shall we? Now, you've all seen these LRO photos where they show lines on them, like we've got here. Now, they're claiming they're the lines from either the astronauts walking or the rover traversing along and disturbing the soil and leaving tracks. Now, folks, what we dealt with up till now is what is claimed to be disturbed soil on the moon turning out to be a darker colour or even black as it is shown here. Now, there is only three conclusions we can arrive at from this photo. And that is, one, the photo is genuine as untaken on the moon, but to accept that you have to accept that there must be water under the surface of the soil and you'll have to find an explanation as to why they haven't dried out within half an hour of the sun shining on them and creating 135 degrees temperature on the surface. That is one thing. Now, the second conclusion is it's not on the moon, it's fake. This is on a moon set here on the Earth where we have got moisture in the soil and hence we would get this darkened area traversing along as I've shown in earlier photos. Now folks, take a look at this photo here. Now just remember what I told you at the start of the video that it was me, the brilliant expat Taffy, that discovered 
this soil color anomaly? I am now convinced that somebody knew it before me. And that is, as you can see here, the photo lab staff that deliberately created this anomaly. Look what they've done with this Mars photo. You've got a patch here showing that black soil disturbed. All that's happened here is somebody have scraped the surface of the soil with some tool and disturbed it and showed it's blacker underneath. If you ask me folks, that is a clue by the whistleblowers telling you that you cannot have any blackened soil underneath like that on the moon or Mars because there is no water on the moon and there's no water on Mars. Now here's another photo from that Mars Curiosity which is going to prove as I done in another video that Curiosity is fake and not on Mars, it's here on the Earth and also confirming again that it's the same staff who made the fake moon landing photos that are making the fake Mars photos today. Do you remember me showing you on the moon photos with the rover having tracks different to the pattern on the wheel? And they've done exactly the same here. You can see the track left in the soil here does not match the track pattern on the wheels. Wheels. Wheels.